So here we have a superb streaming application updated in the last few weeks, giving you access to some fantastic content. Now, this application is absolutely free. It works great on the Fire Stick, on your Android TV devices. It doesn't require any kind of registration, no usernames, no passwords. You don't need to use any kind of mouse toggle. And for most of you, you don't need to use any kind of VPN. So please do take a moment to hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. So with all of that being said, let's get started. If you're started. new to the channel and you want to stay up to date with the latest tech tutorials, the latest Fire Stick, Android and Android TV tips and tricks, then please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. It's a small click from you, but it makes a big difference to me. Thank you. And just a quick reminder, guys, that my second channel is now live. We've just recently hit 5,000 subscribers with your support, so I really appreciate that. And if you guys are looking for bonus content, updates to older videos, and also live streams, so my first live stream did go really well. I really enjoyed answering your questions, just interacting with the community, so I will be doing another live stream in the next few days. So double check and just make sure you hit the subscribe button, you hit that bell with all notifications, and this way you'll know exactly when I post my next video or when I go live. So again, really appreciate your support. Now the application in question is called ABC, and this was updated on the 2nd of December. And with this new version, they've added lots more free content, free TV shows, and even some live TV. Now this application is designed for the USA audience. Now the application has a really nice clean interface and all of the navigation can be done with the standard remote control without using any kind of mouse toggle. Now at the top here we can see we have a couple of sections. So we have home, we have a browse section, we do have a live TV section, search and an account. Let's go to the account first. Now I've not created any account on this, not registered anything, but if you did want to create a free ABC account, you can do that by going to that web address and this will then allow you to save your watch list or save your favorites and also continue watching where you left off. Now the application also allows you to link your TV provider. So if you are paying for a subscription with another provider, you can link that with the ABC application and it will aggregate all of that content into this application. But again, my demonstration, I don't want to do any registration. I just want to show you what you can access absolutely free. Let's go back to the home section. So here you'll see some of the uh, popular content, some of the trending content. Let's scroll down. And here we can see some of the brands that are supported. So we have National Geographic, we have FX, Freeform, and ABC News. Let's get down here. So here we can see some uh, very recent uh, ABC episodes. Lots of different things in here, lots of different shows, lots of very popular shows. Let's scroll down. Then here is the actual uh, popular section. So for example, if you're interested in this uh, Grey's Anatomy, let's click on that. Give that a second. And we can see this is the very latest season 18. So it's not a case of this application is going to show you very old content or, or very old shows. The stuff you see in here will be very recent and you will actually be looking at the latest episodes in this application. Uh, for a quick test, let's try uh, this one here. Give that a second and we are straight into that content. And that really is a fantastic HD picture. And that's one of the things with these official streaming applications is not only is most of the content or all of the content in high definition, because these are official applications, you're not really going to see any kind of stuttering or buffering or anything like that because these applications have the backend infrastructure to handle all of the users that want to access the free content. And we see that's working absolutely fine. Let's press back. Now these applications are typically ad supported so you may see an advert before the content starts but let's go back. Here we can see the drama section and again it does say at the top there no sign in is needed. And then here we have a comedy section, lots of different shows, lots of different episodes. Let's go down then we have some uh, reality TV, uh, throwback premieres, uh, crime tales. And here are some of the other services that if you already have an account with your provider, you can then watch for free. Now, one thing I did notice that when I did actually start something, if I go right back to the top, 
we can see it does actually allow you to continue watching so you don't even need to create a free account to use the continue watching feature let's go to the top let's go to browse and now we can see another way of uh, watching the content on here which has been categorized into a different genres so if i go to the left here for example i'm only interested in drama i can click on that and this will then filter out all of the content for me let's get over to live tv but I think there's only a couple of channels in here. I think one of them is the news. Yeah, so not much in the uh, live TV section. Let's go to search. And if any of you guys are still here with me, then if you drop a like on this video and leave the comment hashtag ABC, then I know you made it this far in the video, which I really appreciate. I'll then heart your comment. Here, for example, I can click on search. Now I can use my voice and say, Jimmy click on next and this should now find all of the content matching that search string which I can then click on choose one of these episodes and again within a couple of seconds or should I say five there we are so we are straight into that content and that's working great let's back out of that it's a great looking application lots of current content current tv shows latest episodes doesn't require any kind of registration no mouse toggle and as the majority of my audience is in the united states for you guys you don't need to use any kind of vpn so that's the application there let me now show you how you can get this on all of your devices okay so to get the latest version of this abc app just head over to your settings go down into myfi tv click on developer options click on install unknown apps and make sure downloader is set to on and this means that we can download applications through Downloader and then install them. Once you've confirmed that, let's now open up Downloader and let's make a quick connection to my website, which is just techdoctoruk.com. Or you can type in the short code 53402. Let's type that in and click on go. Or you can just press the play button on your remote. Now, when you get to my site, if you head over to the hamburger menu, which is one with the three lines, let's click on that and then click on tutorials and the latest tutorial in the list will be how to get this updated version of the ABC application. Let's open that up. Let's scroll down. Here we can see some information about the application, some of those shows that it supports. Keep scrolling down. Here we are. So this is the December update. Let's click on that. Scroll down and you're looking for this green download button. Let's click on that. We can now click on install. That's all done. Let's click on done. We can now delete the installation file. Click on delete again. Let's now press the home key. And that's the latest version of this application all working fine. So that's all for this video, guys. Many thanks for watching. I do think this application with all of those latest episodes, latest shows is worthwhile checking out especially because it doesn't require any registration. So if you did find this video useful, then do give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more stuff like this, then make sure you are subscribed with all notifications and I'll hopefully catch up with you guys real soon. Thanks.